This is day four. I have not found shit. At least not anything worth making a video on. So hopefully today, it's Thursday, up here at the Goodwill in Johns Creek, I had dropped some stuff off. So it is uh, discount day. So maybe we can find something. I'm looking for a small little desk that I need for uh, my setup to put some uh, retro stuff on so I'm looking for that and I'm also looking for electronics or just stuff I can flip so fingers crossed today I'll actually have a video for you so without further ado this is Goodwill Hunter thrifting All right guys, well, we're back at work. Uh, I'm gonna go inside, eat some lunch, and edit this video, but we did find some stuff at that Goodwill. For 15 bucks, I found this digital soldering station from Radio Shack. Uh, I could probably sell that. It is complete from what I can tell. Uh, I believe it doesn't have a sponge, but that's okay. Uh, it is complete as far as that. It has the manual, turns on. And uh, I think they go for anywhere between 60, probably could sell it on eBay for. I already have a nicer one, uh, what is it, uh, Haku, Heiku, Hawk. Uh, it's a nice Japanese uh, company that manufactures a really good soldering station and a lot of other like electronic components, tools. So definitely gonna sell that because I don't need an extra one. The only video game related thing that I found was a PSP charger for four bucks and again, with my discount, I only paid around 40 for everything. So that's a pretty good deal. Uh, don't know what this is, but it looks pretty badass. Uh, it is this giant Philips remote. It's called the SRU8112. It was only four bucks. I don't know if you can see that. Uh, but it has this display and usually remotes like this, like I was hoping it was one of those uh, Logitech the uh, Harmony remotes. I already have one, but it's kind of beat up, but it does work. Uh, this looks like it'll be somewhat for a, maybe a surround sound unit, I guess, or maybe some other type, but it probably sells for a shit ton because this is a very special remote. Uh, it has batteries, but it doesn't seem to power on, but batteries, again, could just be dead. So I took a shot for four bucks. And probably the only thing I'm gonna keep, uh, well, I'm gonna keep the PSP charger because it, oh, it can never really find mine. Uh, is this. It is a Apple, uh, I guess it's called a time capsule. It's a two terabyte wireless router. Um, I have already one of these airport uh, routers, but this one has built in, I guess, two terabytes. It's beefy. Uh, and I want to see if I can use this uh, as the base station and use the other one as kind of like a, uh, a rebroadcaster of my wireless network so I could have more coverage in my house. Um, and that was only 25 bucks. Uh, and these go, I think, like for over 100 bucks. So I'm also curious to see if there's anything on this two terabyte, like what's on there. So that'll be fun uh, to find out. And the last thing is what I'm gonna eat for lunch is this Simply Asia sesame teriyaki bowl. So looks pretty yummy. I got some other stuff to go with it. So that will be it. Uh, so all in all, that was pretty good, uh, you know, hit or miss. They did have another uh, Mac wireless uh, airport router, but it's the same one I have for 25 bucks, so I passed on that. 
they had a uh, PlayStation 2 bundle. Uh, no, I think it had one controller, uh, but no hookups for 15, so that wasn't too bad. I'm really looking for ones that have the network adapter. And they had a Wii, just the Wii, by itself, sold as is for 20 bucks. And uh, that was it. I didn't see any games. They had a nice Sony Bravia TV, but they wanted over 200 bucks. I think 220 bucks for it. And uh, that was it. So pretty good that I found what I found uh, for 40 bucks. I could probably make some decent profit off that. As always, guys, if you like this video, hit the thumbs up. If you didn't like it, hit the thumbs down. And then I want you to go and I want you to drink toilet water. Make sure you don't flush before and just drink some. It's good because whatever goes in your body and comes out is still good. As always, guys, keep up the thrift, and I'll thrift with you later. Woo-woo. Play Blockbuster Video's $20 million win in a flash game. Three out of four win. And while you're at Blockbuster, play the latest releases. Carter Hayes has found the perfect apartment. The perfect landlords. And now the game begins. <gasps> Michael Keaton, Pacific Heights, rated R from CBS Fox Video. Play the $20 million win in a flash game. Blockbuster Video. Wow.